Hey everyone, this is Nicole Spires, Director of Communications here at New Earth, and I am so glad that you could join me for today's Healthy Hustle. At New Earth, we've turned Earth Day into a month-long and beyond event because preserving this Earth for years to come is that important. And when it comes down to it, each and every one of us have the power to make a grand impact. We call it small actions, big results. And we have Amanda Provenzano to walk us through a few of those daily actions. Um, one of the things that we've talked about is small actions, big results. Mm. Because, you know, there's so many of us that share this globe. Um, what are some of those small actions? What can we do on a daily basis? What can any one person you know, really do? Yeah. I think that's a big part of, um, so there's a, there's been a lot of study or some studies, psychological studies around the fear that global or global warming or climate change um, induces in people. And so then we feel like we have no control. Um, and so then a lot of people will just be like, well, just forget about it. Um, but like you're asking, what are some of the small things? I think the biggest thing is awareness um, and understanding where your items are coming from. So when you go to buy something, ask yourself, why are you buying this thing? Where is this thing coming from? Could I borrow it? Or could I rent it instead of purchasing it? What is the need to actually purchase it? Because then if you can, and these are just things that throughout your, you know, your day that thinking about, um, you don't have to get really heavy into all the research um, that I do sometimes. I'm like, all right, where did this iPhone come from? And how was this made? Um, which is, I could also tell you how, how that's done too, if you wanted to know. But um, I think really the, the important aspect of it is recognizing that the supply chain is very removed from um, humans, for, from Americans in particular. So understanding um, where is this product coming from, thinking about the person that's making it or the people that have made it, um, the, all the ingredients that go into it, which is funny to think about besides like food, right? Food is a great way to start um, learning who your farmer is or your local farmers, um, supporting them and, and building a relationship with them. Because then you also know where your food is actually coming from and what is being done to the food. Um, so those are kind of like the, the base start that I would, I, would, I would go with is awareness is really important. Do I really need this? What did it take to make it? Who made it? How far did it have to travel to get here? These are all questions many of us are not in the habit of asking ourselves. However, those small questions can have a profound impact on the way that we purchase and ultimately the health of this earth. It all has to do with our awareness, which of course impacts how we choose to spend our money. We have the power to vote for sustainability with every purchase we do or don't make. So let's exercise that power and make a difference together. It's part of what we call living the new earth life. If you're interested in learning more about eco-friendly living tips, join us for our upcoming 2022 Earth Day Masterclass. You can find a, a link to the event in the description. Thank you all for joining me for today's Healthy Hustle. I hope you found a little bit of information that you can put to use in your daily life to live a more eco-friendly life. We'll catch up with you on the next Healthy Hustle.